Triple Heavens on the Go. Wednesday, March 22nd, 2023. Topic, The Word Produces Faith. Memory Verse, Psalm 119.42. So shall I have wherewith to answer him that reproacheth me, for I trust in thy word. Bible Reading, Psalm 119.42. 49 to 51. Remember the word unto thy servant, upon which thou hast caused me to hope. This is my comfort in my affliction, for thy word hath quickened me. The proud have had me greatly in the reason, yet have I not declined from thy law. The Message one of the most beautiful things about the Word of God is that it produces faith. Romans 10, 17 says, So then, faith cometh by hearing, and hearing by the Word of God. The Word helps faith to swell within you, so much so that you begin to do things that were impossible for you before. Daniel 11.32 says, But the people that do know their God shall be strong and do exploits. The more of God you know, the stronger you become, and the more exploits you can do for Him. There is just something powerful that consumes you when you study your Bible. You begin to see through the eyes of God. You will start to see situations as God sees them. You will become bold and fearless. Things that were impossible to you before will become normal. In fact, you would experience some miracles that will be difficult to testify of as people will find it difficult to believe you. If you can eat the word of God so much, that you are filled with it, then Jesus Christ said, you can ask him for anything and he will do it. John 15, 7. What a great open secret. If you have been wondering why God answers some people's prayers speedily, now you know what to do. Hebrews eleven six 6 says, But without faith, it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to God, must believe that he is and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Since faith cometh by hearing the word of God, and it is impossible to please God without faith, you need the word of God to please him. If you are like me, always crying to God, saying, Lord, I just want to please you, the solution is simple. Soak yourself in the word of God. It is interesting though that fear also comes by hearing. So be careful of what you listen to. Choose to listen to the Word of God. Action point. Choose to fill your heart with the Word of God. Bible reading in one year. 1 Samuel 1-3 him for today. Jesus loves me, this I know. The Open Heavens is written by Pastor E. A. Adeboye, the General Overseer of the Redeemed Christian Church of God. God bless you.